Here's how to use Apple's cool new double tap feature on your existing Apple Watch. Welcome everybody to Apple Insider. It is Andrew here and Apple debuted the Apple Watch Series 9 and second generation Apple Watch Ultra at its Wonderlust event. It also announced new iPhones, new accessories, a bunch of fun software updates. But one of the biggest features coming to the Apple Watch Series 9 and Apple Watch Ultra 2 is a feature called Double Tap. Double Tap allows you to control your Apple Watch with simply a tap of your fingers. It's a really cool way to interact with your watch, especially if one hand is busy, you're holding groceries, holding a child, unlocking a door, whatever it is, and you need to answer a phone call, you need to dismiss a notification, whatever it is, you can just do so with the tap of your fingers. But I'm gonna let you in on a little secret. Apple has had a version of Double Tap available on previous generations of Apple Watch for quite some time. I'm gonna show you how you can use Double Tap and do even more on your existing Apple Watches. So here I have my Apple Watch Ultra. This is the OG, the original Apple Watch Ultra, and it does not technically have Double Tap. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna press my digital crown to go to my home screen, and then I'm going to go into the settings application. I'm gonna then scroll down with the digital crown, or you can swipe until we get to one called accessibility. We're gonna go into the accessibility menu, and I'm gonna scroll down further until I find a feature called assistive touch. It's quite a ways down the list here under motor. So there we have it, assistive touch, and I already have mine turned on, but you're gonna to wanna to make sure you turn yours on and it's gonna walk you through a basic little guide on how to use assistive touch, which includes the double tap gesture. Now that assistive touch is enabled, we can control our Apple Watch just using our hand, which is so cool. So here's the watch. I'm gonna double clench, which is gonna open up the action menu. Sorry, do it a little bit quicker. There's our action menu right there at the bottom. I can tap with one finger to move to the next item on the list, just like that. A double tap will move backwards. Again, double tap moves backwards. One tap to go forward. When I find something that I wanna do, I can clench, which is a single tap, and there we go. I've gone ahead and selected things. It does many of the things that double tap does. So here you can see I'm actually opening the camera app on my phone that's just off screen, and I can go ahead and double tap with my fingers, and boom, I'm counting down three, two, one, and I just took a photo. I did that with all, I can just not even look at my watch, my hand can be down, double tap, it's again triggering, and I can just take a photo just by double tapping my fingers. Hey look, a phone call is coming in, I can just double pinch, and I've answered that call. Well, hello. Hi. Hi, I'm just demoing how you can use double pinch or double tap on your existing Apple Watch to answer a phone call. Thanks. <laughs> I think so, I'll talk to you later. Bye. And just like that, I was able to double tap to end the call. So yeah, many of these double tap gestures work exactly like they do with the double tap action on Series 9 and Apple Watch Ultra 2. Hey, look, a notification came in. I can go ahead and when I look at my watch, pull it up, I can just double tap again to dismiss those notifications. So answering call, controlling music, taking photos, a lot of stuff that Apple demoed up on stage. If you want to get fancy, you can go into settings and you can actually customize these. So if we go to like hand gestures, those are on, but you can customize all these. So pinch is forward, double pinch is backwards as we talked about, clenching is a tap, but you can change all these. So double clench, pull up an action menu or do something else. So there's all these different functions that you can map it to. So assistive touch is super critical here. It has a lot of customization, which is a big differentiator between this assistive touch feature and actual double tap. So that's how you can customize these assistive touch features even further. So really, what's the difference between double tap and assistive touch? Honestly, right now it's a little murky. The biggest changes are that assistive touch is a very verbose system-wide feature where you can control everything. There's the action menu, you're pressing digital crown, accessing side buttons, you're scrolling, all of these things for people who need those accessibility features. Double Tap is a streamlined, simplified version that just allows you to interact with the primary button inside of an application. So you can answer a call, control music playback, snap a photo, whatever it is that that primary functionality would do is what Double Tap will replicate. So it's very similar in functionality, but it's a lot more verbose with assistive touch in for people who need that assistance. Double Tap may also be faster on the new versions of Apple Watch simply because of the S9 SIP inside. It has a better CPU that's more accurately able to detect things like minute motions that something like a Double Tap can do. 
Using assistive touch right now on the existing Apple Watch, it works, but there's sometimes where it doesn't get everything correct and clenches don't always work as I think that they should. And sometimes double taps aren't exactly detected. So it isn't perfect. And I think it will be better on the Series 9 and Apple Watch Ultra 2. But I have been using it for quite a while now. And honestly, just being able to dismiss notifications and answer phone calls with the tap of the finger makes it worth it to turn on for me. Let me know what you guys think. Are you going to enable assistive touch on your Apple Watch? Let me know down below in the comments or on Twitter at Andrew underscore OSU. You can also let me know on threads at Andrew Hera 941. Otherwise, stay tuned because I'll give you a good in-person demo of double tap on the Apple Watch Series 9 and Apple Watch Ultra 2 very soon.